I got sidetracked, didn't I? <laughs> Fatigue starting to set in. Let's finish up that remove item function. So when we use an item, we need to take it out of our inventory. So let's go into our remove item function in our player base blueprint. And we're going to break it open. So we're going to check and see if the current stack is less than or equal to 1. We'll add a branch. If it is less than or equal to 1, then we want to get our inventory. We'll find item. We'll plug in the item we're using. And we will remove that index just like that. So let's drag all this over. Still not able to do the reroute. Not sure what's happening, but I'll just do it like this. So if it's not less than or equal to 1, that means it's greater than 1, and we need to still find that index. But what we'll do is we'll promote this to a local variable called used item. Plug that here and there. Grab out that used item and plug it here. I'll drag this back up. That looks a lot better. And then we're basically going to do the same thing here. So control C and control V to copy and paste that down below. We're going to set array element. So the index will be the index of the item we're trying to use. And we will make our item info here by breaking open our item info here. Then we'll plug in all our wires just like this, just like last time. Tedious, but works. From the current stack, we'll do a subtract. We want to subtract one, add our rest of our Oy. and then after we remove the item from our inventory we need to get our HUD ref and is it build invent rebuild inventory so we'll rebuild the inventory whether we remove it completely or remove an item from it. So let's check and see how this is working. It's not working. Crap, I just closed the event graph. If you ever close your event graph, you can just go right here and double click it and it brings it back up. And then here is some list of all the graphs you have in here. So let's check. So when we double click on something we're selecting it. When we use the item swap weapon remove item. Oh! So we'll plug in the health item to the remove item function just for now. And then I can double click, it removes it, removes it, removes it. Just like that. Huzzah. Let's check it with the multiplayer. So, got a couple things, used it, just like that. The hatchet's not hooked up because the tool wasn't hooked up, but we got our stuff working. So let's double check something real quick. So I'm going to jump in with both players, pick up some stuff with this one, pick up.
pick up some stuff with this one. And now, let's see. So yeah, both players can use their inventory and it doesn't impact the other one. Awesome. And everything is removing appropriately, so awesome. Double awesome. Alright, so let's save everything real quick and in the next one then we'll jump into the attack trace and all that jazz. <laughs> so, well let's go ahead, let's see. Tool, remove item. Well, we ain't gotta worry about all this right now. It's all working the way we want it, so we'll do our or restore health and equip tool and all that before we feed it into the remove item. Important thing is that's working. So, alright, I will see y'all in the next one. Bye bye.